Ace Money the name, getting paid by the game. My goal is to help you get that money by sharing my picks as well as some useful knowledge and betting techniques. Now, while we go over this recap, I'd like to get right into these picks so we can get in and out like a BNE with handicapping. So it's the SBR, Sportsbook Robbery. What's going on? I'm Ace Money, and this is Sportsbook Robbery. It's uh, Monday Night Football, NFL, 2nd of December. We got Cleveland at Denver. Uh, Denver by six and a half, and uh, total forty-one and a half. Uh, been kind of staying away from primetime games. Books got the line so sharp and usually raised up. Um, a little quick snaps matchup. It's team rankings. Always like to look at this. Uh, basically, read it. Cleveland versus Denver. In the category, and then it would be Denver versus Cleveland. So, like overall, you got points per game. Cleveland, sixteen point nine. They're thirty first, almost last. Denver, this is what they're giving up. Sixteen. They rank second. So, complete opposite ends of the spectrum. Uh, Denver is scoring twenty two. They're seventeenth, and uh, Cleveland's giving up twenty four. It's ranked twenty third. A few things I like to read it's all third down conversions, everything it helps break down both games. And then, uh, rushing, rushing yards a game, uh, 88 Cleveland ranked 29th, poor Denver's defense giving up 96, ranked sixth. Uh, rushing yards, Denver ranked 20th. Getting 111, and Cleveland's defense ranked 23rd, giving up 130. You know, it's kind of already off the rip just reading a couple things right there. It's saying Cleveland's going to win. Uh, Denver's going to win. I'm sorry. Um, passing yards, Cleveland 204, ranked 21st. Denver's giving up uh, 199, ranked 9th. Denver is getting 201 passing yards, ranked 23rd. Cleveland giving up 214, rank 16th. It's a little closer in that aspect. Uh, field goals, Cleveland ranked 30th. Uh, Denver ranked 10th. Big difference right there. Denver got a better kicker. Uh, turnovers. Denver. Denver takeaways uh, 21st, giveaways 11. Da -da -da, time of possession, penalties is a big thing. Player props, uh, so many props won't cash because it'd be a penalty. It's like a wasted play, it happens all the time. Uh, illegal man downfield, illegal uh, shift, illegal formation, run play options. That's what ends up being the illegal man downfield when the lineman goes a little too far. But uh, I got a few player props. Let's get right into them. So, while we're on the topic of football, how about my fucking bills, huh? Yeah. Doing that. All right, so uh, Bo Nix, rookie. He's doing real good this year. Good coach. They're, they're combining real good. Um Passing touchdowns over one and a half, plus 108, FanDuel, uh, minus 110 on all the other books. His so last few games, four out of the last five, he's gone over this uh, versus Atlanta. The Falcons, he had four touchdowns, passing touchdowns for the year. A little rough start, as expected, but uh, he's been going over this. Passing touchdowns against Cleveland, ranked 16th. Giving up 1.4. I don't know how you give up 1.4. But uh, he's exceeded one and a half. Passing TDs for his last five games. Averaging 2.2. Uh, yeah, I think he's going to go over in prime time. Playing at home. Let's get it. Most of these are Denver plays. Uh, there's a couple of receivers, a couple of the main guys are hurt. Not all of them, but uh, so Valley, he's been showing up. Uh, 
I like his first quarter over five and a half. It's basically one reception on uh, FanDuel. This number has gone up and has changed. Um, three, is this on the year? Yeah, for the year, three, four, five times he's cleared this. Um, this is full game. He's getting those receptions. The safer bet would be full game, which I like that too. Uh, he's exceeded four and a half in five of his last six games, averaging 13. Just need one catch, right? Uh, first quarter props I always do half units. His receiving yards are at 39 and a half. I do like that too. His last two games, he's gone over it. Uh, Cleveland, as we were saying earlier, not that great at. Uh, Sorry. Come on. Overall, rank 18th to the wide receiver, rank 25th. So, uh, what does it say? Reynolds does not be active, foot injury. So, basically, everyone's moving up. Uh, you have Sutton's wide receiver one, then you got Valley. Then you have Humphrey, then you have Franklin and Mims. Uh, Reynolds won't play for a couple weeks. I also have plays for Franklin and Mims. They got their yards real low. All right, so Mims, Marvin Mims Jr. Uh, they got his yards at 13 and a half receiving yards. The last two games, he went over this. Uh, he had two receptions, I believe. Actually, a couple more than that. Uh, five targets, three receptions, two for two, four for four, one for two, one for two, three for two for three. Uh, definitely, there was two of them that were long, 37 yards but on both games. So he's definitely a deep threat. Uh, the other ones were shorter. Um I just think he's going to get an opportunity. He needs one pass. A good way to read the books. Receiving yards, you see they got it minus 110. Now if I go to receptions, they got over one and a half. Minus 108, 120. All right, this isn't the one. There's another one that's highly juiced. But... uh. Yeah, just the last two games, him being that deep threat, getting them a couple passes. I feel like if he gets one, he's getting all them targets. The other guy's out. Uh, they're playing at home. I feel like he'll get one reception. Go over this. All right, if you could, like the video. New viewers, hit that subscribe button. Just turn on your notifications so you get all my plays, my live bets. Anything I do, uh, I just try to keep you in the loop. Uh, first and foremost, I'm a sports better. New to this YouTube and stuff. Uh, that's why my videos will come out late. Uh, gathering intel, I'm chasing the lines, uh, you know, I'm grinding. NBA, NFL, uh, I haven't really gotten hockey yet. Just too much between the other sports right now. Do all three for myself. Uh, takes a lot of time to do these videos. So hit that like button for me. Hit that subscribe. And uh, let's leave a comment if you got some extra time. Like some comments. Help get the videos out there. As well as I don't get paid for this. So it's some interaction between us. that makes it feel worth it. Uh, Troy Franklin. Receiving yards. You know, uh, Knicks is spreading the ball around as you see all these plays getting some yardage. Uh, besides Sutton, he's getting six, seven receptions himself. You know, they're passing it around. Um, such a low number, two, 14 and a half. They're playing at home. He's cleared this the last two games. Uh, three, four, five, six out of the last eight games. He's went over this. Definitely dropped a couple for 50 percent right here. Four targets, two receptions, two for two. You know, I don't know if he's a deep threat. I, honestly, I don't know too much about it. I'm just reading into the stats and data. Um, 
but he's been going over it. You take a look at his receptions. He got a one and a half. Uh, this is the one I was looking at earlier. Minus 150, 130. So, you know, those are odds. The odds they give you is the percentage that they're going to hit. Like minus 150, that's a 60% chance they're giving it to hit. Um, you know, higher the juice, the more likely the easier to play is to hit. So they're trying to say he's going to get at least two receptions. Two receptions, he's going to go over this uh, 13 and a half yards or whatever it is. I can look at you can look at the sports book on the app itself and kind of figure out what plays to pick just by looking at the numbers going back and forth. But uh fifteen and a half, I think it'll go over it. What the line just changed. Was it fifteen and a half? Definitely line shop, odd shop, have multiple books. Yeah, line changed. Uh you can also live bet. Right when the game starts, the lines are coming down. I do that a lot. Uh, yeah, let's move on. All right, so this last one is for the Browns. Uh, tight end Jordan Atkins. Receiving yards over 17 and a half. Minus 110 FanDuel. 130, 140, 150. Other books. Uh, line did go up. Uh... Last three easily cleared this. What do we got? Seven out of eleven for the year. Uh, four targets, three receptions last game. Dropped a couple of the game before. Three for four. Oh for one. Four for four. I guess it depends, right? But uh, he's exceeded seventeen and a half for his last five. Average of twenty six. Denver overall ranked 10th in receiving yards. They're still giving up some yards. So I'm going to twist 220 yards a game. Uh, 43 to the tight end, ranked 10th. Uh, Joku, always a good play. Judy, you know, all these guys, but they got their numbers so high. Uh, Cooper's on my bills. Uh you could always do a running back, do a couple of mixed parlays. I don't know. I liked, ran through it kind of quick. These, I liked all these. Uh, I will be looking to live bet. Just turn on your notifications so you get my plays. I'll drop them in the community. Um, yeah, I appreciate everyone. Eat some money in the name, getting paid for the game. Let's go. Check out my NBA video.